so before we start the RuneScape stream and we do our ideas and stuff like that, um, I was told, right, by certain individuals, I don't know who, that community shucking is no longer a thing anymore, and I believe deathmatching is no longer a thing. So let's start by browsing the RuneScape section. Mm, let's see. So I see literally nobody deathmatching. I see somebody saying, looking for loan. <laughs> that boy LMS until somebody gives him GP. New bikini photos. Deathmatching. Okay. 18 plus homeless after this weekend. Expected after a deathmatching stream. Wow. I, the, the RuneScape section actually looks clean. Like it's been wiped off with a cloth and some Windex. We love that. Okay, community chucking. As you know, the main reason for the dual arena's removal, chat take notes, was to stop activity which was deemed unacceptable in the line with our rules. However, we have noticed that since the introduction of the PvP arena, these rule breaking activities have been adapted accordingly. Okay, okay chat, That's a, that is a noted moment. All right, chucks or chucking refers to PvP duels created with high stakes. Sometimes involving a middleman where a player A that matches player B. If player A loses, they get nothing. But if they win, they receive the double of the initial wager. It's obvious. That's like staking. It's like the duel arena. Okay. Community shucks take this a step further though. Okay, talk to me. What is that? I actually misinformed. Player A may deathmatch on behalf of player C, D, etc. But using player C's GP, the same rules apply. If player A wins, it's player C who receives double the payout. Oh, shit. But player A will normally receive a cut of the winnings, and in some cases, they will, be refu they will refuse to play player C because they didn't get their cut. That wasn't me, chat. Chat, zombie sheep. All I said was zombie sheep. I never did that shit. That's cap. That was the... I never did that. I never refused to pay anybody with the sheepness. If you were sheep with me, all I did was flame you. I mean or no? I mean or no, chat? These activities essentially mirror commission staking and have become increasingly pr prevalent among previous residents of the Duel Arena. Okay. I don't know why they had to say it like that. No. <laughs> They're talking as if like we're addicts or something. You know what I'm saying? We want to be clear. Community shucking, whether hosting or participating, is not allowed and violates the game of chance section of our game rules. This apl applies regardless of whether or not the host receives a tip or not. Furthermore, any staking or dueling with the help of a middleman is also not allowed. And he's staking or dueling with the hell. Okay, so what I'm getting at here so far is community chucking is done forever, correct? Or am I incorrect? We'll take action against accounts or individuals involved in staking and chucking. Okay. These activities also encourage the purchase of accounts created and made with the intention of staking, which directly contradicts our rules around real trading. Okay. So, um,. What I'm getting at here is you can deathmatch yourself. So me, I can deathmatch my own GP. And if I go against a viewer, I can hold the GP and I can pay them out. You know, no, no, t no, no tip, no, none of that. I can deathmatch my own GP, but I can't community chuck. No, that's bannable. So wait, time out. How do you expect me to deathmatch if I can't hold the viewers as GP? I'm not going to trust some random guy with a two build versus two build DH deathmatch and expect them to pay me after you can't then how the fuck is some people actually deathmatching deathmatching new bikini photos we have a woman that's not even showing her face but showing her top what an amazing individual let's see who else is advertising deathmatching austin 07 is advertising deathmatching so deathmatching is no longer a thing i'm assuming that this is the end of deathmatching in all honesty chat can i can i give can i can i can i say something you can deathmatch and hold GP. You're not middlemaning, just trusted, right? That's what I was perceiving at, but some, some people in my chat are saying no. Either way, I want, you know, so if deathmatching is done, I think that's a plus in terms of PvP because that would make more people rely on the PvP aspect of the game to make fast money. I mean or no? So people will, will be more initiating to fight risk fighters and such like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, let's say, let's say I do a that's crazy offer and I say five bill versus 500 mil. 1 bill versus 100 mil and 500 mil versus 50 mil. People are going to be intrigued to do that because they want fast GP. And if deathmatching is no longer a thing, they're going to come to me about it. I'm Papa O and they're going to come fight Papa O and then I'm going to obliterate them for the 50 mil. And I can put, it's crazy, offers in my title and then do crazy ass PKs on it. So now the next part of this is rerolling giveaways. We'd like to reaffirm our position on reroll giveaways, which is something we've already taken action on. For those unfamiliar, reroll giveaways an activity where a participant enters, sometimes at a fee, for the chance of winning something. 
Once a number of players have entered, the host will pick a random winner from the list of entrants. After the winner is chosen, the viewers are allowed and sometimes encouraged to send the host an off-site donation or a tip normally in form of real-world money to re-roll the result of the giveaway. This can happen any number of times, which is a potentially infinite number of re-rolls. These type of giveaways are not allowed. Capital N-N-O-T. Holy shit. As they violate the rules found in the real-world trading section. You know, I'm not going to lie. I've seen a lot of people do this, and then I started doing it myself. So I hopped on the trend. I, I didn't give a fuck. I'm not going to lie to you. I've seen a lot of small streamers doing it, so I'm like, you know what? Fuck it. Why don't I do it too? You know what I'm saying? So I did do it, and I don't see anything wrong with it, right? Like, obviously, it's kind of shameless that you're re-rolling a guy because you're getting five subs. But at the end of the day, that is somebody's hustle. If they choose to do that, at the end of the day, it's, he's hustling. I don't, I, don't see your, I don't see why there's so many... I'm, I'm not going to name names. Alkin, sorry, sorry, sorry. That was very disrespectful of me. But I, 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 there's so many PVM streamers or skilling streamers that once they see something, they will talk bad about it immediately. They'll be like, uh, why is this allowed? Or why is this allowed? Or... Why are sub, like, I remember back in the day, a couple of years ago, there was sub only giveaways, a thing where in the RuneScape section, Alkin and all these PVMers were like, why is that a thing? Can, they could just do sub only giveaways that will make everybody sub to them. How is that fair? Like all these PVMers were talking about them, but they could do the same thing too. But the reason why they don't is because they don't PVP and make quick money fast. So they don't want to waste their PVMing bank where they work so hard for. I did eight hours of forecast for this 48 mil. You know what I'm saying? Like. They work so hard for their GP, they, they, get, they get mad because we're getting so many subs from doing a sub-only giveaway. You know what I'm saying? So the PvP streamers were, I guess, rising in sub count and they weren't. And they complained about it and then they made a rule about sub-only giveaways. And now they're making a rule about this. I'm not mad about this. Um, I think it's the right thing to do. But I, I, I do want to say I hate the fact that PvMing and slash skilling streamers talk bad about certain PvP streamers when they, they're only hustling. You know? I, I, I like... I'll name some names, like I've seen, seen 61M, Epis, Vink, all those guys. Uh, okay, some of those guys I obviously don't like. You know me, guys. I don't like anybody in the fucking RuneScape section ex except for a hand, a hand pick a few. But what I'm saying is they, they're hustling, bro. Even if I don't like them, I'll be honest. They're hustling for real money, right? And uh, you know what I'm saying? I just don't understand that. But Oda, they had no problem reverting the red X changes that allows you to do bossing without taking damage. Kek W. Bro, I don't know, man. Like, it just, uh, I don't know. It doesn't matter. I don't care. Okay, advertising. We also want to make clear that advertising any of, uh, of the above activities, rule or trading sites or gambling services is not allowed. We will continue to take action on any accounts involved with advertising services that directly break the game rules of RuneScape. Is anybody in the RuneScape section doing that right now? Let's see. Anybody advertising any websites here? Let's see. Oh, this individual. Hey there, it's bad to advertise that website. You can get banned at Nerd. <laughs> Yo, what the fuck? So now we're going to read the comments about everything. These are ac action, not words. And then the second most upvoted is just banned oil block already and set an example. The man is America personified, forcing tips like a waiter in a restaurant for his cringe duels. Limo, only older block fans would report this message for self-harm. Thanks for conforming to the stereotype. Sorry, I was trying to talk like him. Um, so we, we, we have a guy right here, chat, that is uh, obviously mad. You know, he's, uh, he's quite angry. <laughs> he's quite angry. He's mad that Gagax didn't ban me. Um, the thing is, they just... How are you going to ban me when they didn't put out the rule yet? So they just clarified and put out the rule that this was bannable. I did nothing wrong. I did community shocks for a few days. I uploaded it to YouTube. It was good content. People liked it. I stopped it. I didn't continue. I made my bank. I'm happy with it. I'm, I'm chilling. You know what I'm saying? The reason why they're mad is because they can't afford that Tebow that they want. Well, guess what, buddy? I could buy 50 of them. <laughs> I, could, I could buy 48 Ellie's if I wanted to. You know what I'm saying? I could buy 100 sites if I want to, buddy. You like that? Actually, let me show my bank offer real quick. Oh, what the fuck? I got 10 billion gear on. Excuse me. Let me let me not flex here. Oh, what is that over there? Oh, no. That's about 18 max cash tags. <laughs> it's too late, buddy. Understand? I, I didn't break any rules. Understand? I didn't advertise the website, so I didn't do any RWT. I didn't 
I didn't do any of that. And now that the rule is out, I will never do that ever again as well. Okay, let, let's check the other message. Ban Oda, filter the fucking coin game bots already. 900 upvotes. Why does anybody want me banned? I'm not understanding. Why do I have so many haters? I'm not, I'm not understanding. Can a man not just eat his plate in peace with a little bit of Sprite on the side? Can I not just, can I, can I not just eat, can I just not eat my plate and just like drink my water in peace? Putting not allowed in bold, lol, you tried ban like banning these rule bakers instead. Okay. Okay, I don't even know what that means, but chat, what does that mean? What is he implying? Any smart people in the chat? What does that mean? He's talking about photosynthesis. Ah, yes, the mitochondria. They want Gagex to take proper action. On what though? Because they did take action. They banned Abdullah. They banned Mo Yuzan. They banned Stella. They banned so many people that were breaking the rules. I didn't break any rules. All I did was community shucking. I didn't, uh, in, in the game of chance where they, where, they, where they said here, they said, they said, what's it called? They said, uh, uh, in some cases, players here uh, will refuse to pay the guy if they didn't get their tip. Their, 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 their tip. So like, let's say if I did a death match for you and you didn't tip me, I would refuse to pay you. I've never did that once. I can see why that's, that's bannable, but now it's bannable because they made a rule about it. So obviously it's bannable in general now. You cannot do community cooking, and I understand that. Thing is, like, you guys can ban the people for advertising the websites. You guys can ban the people that are WT. You guys can ban the people that don't pay out their viewers. But me, I'm not in the chat. I'm not even trying to act humble. I'm not trying to act like I'm a good guy. But I don't ever do my viewers dirty. I don't, I don't, do, I don't do my viewers dirty. Even when I was deathmatching, for you guys' GP, I would only look for a 50-50 deathmatch. So basically, I would only look for a DH versus DH, and I wouldn't look for anything else because I was scared to lose you guys' odds. That's how much I cared. Like, you saw a lot of these guys giving first hit for D-Claws, Elder Maul, and shit like that. All the streamers doing all types of deathmatches that they could find. Me, I made sure that you guys only get DH and DH only from, from uh, I don't care how long it took, because I didn't want you guys to lose any sort of odds because I treated you guys' GP like my own GP. Because if I didn't, that's just shameless of me. You know what I'm saying? That's just disrespectful at that point. I, I didn't, I didn't like, and then that, and, 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 and for the tip thing, whoever said no tip, I automatically accepted. Oh, but Oda, didn't you call people sheep? That's pressuring. Okay, what are we in fucking middle school? I'm not understanding, elementary school? Hey man, you're a sheep. Oh gosh, I guess I have to pay him. I'm not, <laughs> I'm not understanding here, bro. I call you a sheep, you're gonna give me whatever you want? Oh, I know it's not your call, Jagex Sarni, but these types of posts do nothing. It did something. Nobody's doing it anymore except for two. Everyone already knows it's against the rules. They just don't care. If Jagex wants to handle on this, they know to swing the band hammer hard on high profile players that are doing it. People like Apis and Oda do it constantly on stream, so everyone sees that and realizes they can get away with it too. Motherfucker, when? I stopped community chucking three weeks ago. <laughs> when did it? When, uh, in, in the first days of my subathon, I did community chucking for fun for you guys and it was content, then I stopped. I never did it again. But even if I did it before this rule, why would that matter? They just made a rule about it. Move on, you fucking hippo. I'm not, I'm not understanding, bro. These, you know what blows my mind? Can I tell you guys something, chat? People will act like, like, I don't know. I don't know. This is not me. I'm too focused on my own life and my own happiness to care about what anybody else does. And I feel like there's so, some of you guys that are exactly like me because you mean, me and my chat relate a lot. Like we have the same humor. We're the same people. Like, I guess you could say we're the same people. You know what I'm saying? What I don't realize is how someone, like I know you guys could feel the same way about this. How someone could go on their computer, dedicate time to take 30 minutes to write a post like, hey guys, I think we should ban Autoblock here because technically he didn't stop till 1.2 weeks ago and 3.8 weeks ago was actually the rule clarified. And I don't, I don't understand how you could dedicate time to do that. Like bro, move on with your life. Go be productive yourself. Why are you talking about me or somebody else? Or I never got that. I guess th they say high profile because they don't want to say Oda. You know what I'm saying, chat? Just say my name. I know everybody loves my name. Just say it. <laughs> it's actually Omar if you want to use it. You know what I'm saying? It's the, you don't have to say Oda. Just say my name. You guys want me banned. It's okay. It's Omar. O-M-A-R. That's my name. Thank you, brother. Accents speak louder than words. I've played this game for about 15 years plus. When I first started playing, the bands and mutes were swift. Wrongdoing was dealt with quickly. Douglas, if you want this stuff to stuff, what the fuck does, what the fuck does that even mean? If y'all want this stuff to stuff, Watch the streams, get your evidence, and ban them. <laughs> Yo, I can see this guy going like this. Why are you guys just stuff to stuff here? 
And he's just like pulling up his glasses, slob, you know what I'm saying? Has a buzz cut. His lips are like baloney lips, you know what I'm saying? Like he probably eat his own lips if he put some seasoning on it. Now we say, now band Oda. This guy just says to ban me, expected, you know what I'm saying? You know what, let's just control F and see what Oda and see what pops up. All right, let's see, chat. I am pretty sure all these people doing this know quite well what they are doing. Unfortunately, just reminding people, is it enough? You guys need to take some aggression action. I would start by knocking out key people, like Oda. Nothing short of IP banning will send the right message. What a fucking absolute willow tree, bro. What the fuck am I reading, bro? These guys think that they're like a hero or something, that they can just spout information. Like, I'm not, this absolute fucking hippopotamus shit, man. What is this guy saying? I'm not understanding, bro. It's pathetic. It's pathetic, bro. 